The New Age movement is an important force in contemporary American culture. New Agers seek to live out their beliefs in the transformation of themselves and of society. They seek to transform every facet of their individual lives, and one key to that personal transformation resides in the realm of human psychology. Achieving collective consciousness is the main goal for cosmic humanists. New Age psychology is based on one simple principle, commune with your own divine essence, the God within. The New Age is so fixated on self, self-actualization, self-development, and that's how many of the New Age programs are put across. Uh, whether it's yoga, meditation, whatever, it is all for the sake of finding yourself, realizing your higher self, and, and coming to your full potential as a self, as a person. The popular New Age guru, Deepak Chopra, proclaims the only clear path to God is a path of constant self-awareness. Deepak even goes so far as to declare, I believe that God has to be known by looking in the mirror. Shirley MacLaine proclaimed a similar message in her movie, Out on a Limb. I am I God. God. I am God. I am God. I am I God. God. I am I God. God. The New Age movement combines certain schools of psychology with Eastern spirituality. New Agers use the theories of Abraham Maslow, Carl Rogers, Carl Jung, and Rollo May to evaluate our view of humanity as having unlimited potential. In contrast to the Christian understanding of humans as sinful, Maslow believed that since our inner nature is good or neutral rather than bad, it is best to bring it out and encourage it rather than to suppress it. If it is permitted to guide our life, we grow healthy, fruitful, and happy. Maslow promoted a psychology of self-actualization. Rogers promoted a psychology of self-realization. Young advocated collective consciousness. In the end, each person accomplishes the goal of realization by satisfying his or her own needs and desires. This view helped give rise to the human potential movement. This expressed itself in such common slogans as, I'm okay, you're okay. The focus is upon the self, upon developing our own personal humanity. The human potential movement encourages people to change from older Western ways of thinking into a newer Eastern way of thinking. But New Age psychology focuses on more than just individual development. Their focus is on the collective. The New Age goal is to raise a collective consciousness so that humanity can further its psychological and spiritual evolution. In this way, the well-being of the entire world could be secure and assured. New Agers believe that our thinking creates reality. Mind over matter is a common slogan. Thus, our thinking ultimately determines our failure or success in life. This belief also affects how one understands health and illness in life. People suffering through painful sickness or disease are doing so because they have not yet achieved higher consciousness. We are not really victims of illness or disease, we just think we are. As Shirley MacLaine writes, we are not victims of the world we see, we are victims of the way we see the world. In truth, there are no victims, there is only self-perception and self-realization. To achieve a higher state of consciousness, cosmic humanists use meditation, sometimes aided by crystals or mantras, or even by drugs. In order to commune with the universe and your divine nature, you need to meditate and look within. Many New Agers also believe in an ability to channel spirits. They believe that spirits will sometimes speak through a gifted person in an altered state of consciousness. Channeling has been made popular through a variety of books, as well as through mainstream movies such as Ghost. Many New Agers believe the spirits channeled are those of ascended masters, people who have traveled through the earth plane and achieved a high level of consciousness. They will help us find our way in life, so we too can gain an enlightened consciousness. Not every member of the New Age movement sees much significance in channeling, but all New Agers embrace meditation as an important tool for attaining higher consciousness. This enlightened state of mind can be further enhanced through astrology, yoga, firewalking, Ouija boards, crystals, out-of-body experiences, near-death experiences, drugs, sex, guided visualization, and other esoteric practices. <laughs>